Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. We are back on Skybounds for another exciting and fun filled episode, so let's get at it. So Ben and I did get the other uh, factory machines going here. I had um, this one doing granite, or no, so originally it was doing ice, and then I switched it to granite, and I put this one in doing coal, and we still got a ways to go, and it's level four and continuing to go up. This one's only uh, level two. But I'm kind of out of ore seeds, so I think we're just going to let that one sit there, uh, not doing much for a while. Uh, we got the wood cutting machine, and then uh, I put this wood cutting machine as an acacia, um, because it turns out that is the, it all depends on your island level as to what wood you can put in those darn machines. So I would have to get up to, I saw it in here have to get up to level 33 in order to put dark oak in there and then it's uh, something like um, 44 yep so I have to get to 40 level 44 before I can use the netherwood saplings uh, so we're gonna hold off we'll just use the acacia saplings for now and I'm just uh, I think I, every once in a while I put some in storage and then uh, sell the rest the uh, um, Watermelon farming machine here is cranking along, uh, still on its using 11 watermelon seeds. I probably need to do something with that. The change that I made was I put a conveyor belt in between here and this compactor, and then put an input uh, block here with a chest on top. So now when I uh, harvest out the watermelon from that chest up there, I can drop them in here, gets compacted, and bada bing, bada boom. We get um, uh, watermelon, but I just went ahead and made a bunch of frozen watermelon and sold it. I think I was up to 320k or something like that. So yeah, so this works pretty good. Um, so I don't have to spend time compacting the watermelon, even though it doesn't take that long. It's now it's easier to just get it all in one place and drop it in there. So that's uh, the one change, the one big change I made over here. And we still, oh yes, yeah, so I've got this uh, farming machine doing sugarcane. Um, it's on level four too, so we just got it cranking through. That's until I get done with when I get done with cocoa, I'll probably change this one over to um, to cocoa, I think. Uh, and I'm just selling the sugarcane for the most part. Uh, one of the things I did want to point out that. Uh, there is a, if we look at uh, islands again, on upgrades, max factory blocks. So, yep, there's a limit on the number of factory blocks you can place on the island. Right now I'm at 25. Um, uh, I don't know how many I've got down. I'd have to go count them. Uh, but, yeah, so you want to make sure you're being efficient with the factory uh, blocks and that you don't get too carried away or else you'll be spending $10 million to upgrade it by five which isn't an awful lot so then over here I've now got um, ran out of chicken spawn eggs which is kinda good this guy is all the way up to level four now too and um, so I put the witch eggs in there we got 600 of those left and then over here I added in the uh, mahi mahi and we got some of those left with um, uh, we're at level three there, should hit level four pretty soon. But keep an eye on that. I uh, want to make sure you upgrade the levels as soon as you can. And uh, so I got the same thing here the output coming in here. And then uh, we've got right now, I've got it set to collect the magic essence and the malum. And then the cook stuff comes over here and I can sell it out of there. So, yep, so that's good. I think we got a, a pretty good handle on these uh, darn factory machines now. So, um, as soon as I get that auto crafter uh, fixed, we'll be uh, making some changes to take advantage of that. Now, this darn guy, I think this guy is broken. I, I, I think he's broken. Look at this. So, um, uh, it's uh, they need to change. They need to change this because this is at one hour. It's 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 one per four hours. <laughs> <laughs> not one per one hour and uh, so far all I've been getting are these darn things I actually had four I went ahead and opened up one early today uh, actually really early this morning and these message in a bottle is not one that you can combine as far as I know into um, a better better loot so 
the first one I opened, I got two uh, sardines and a tin recipe pages. So I think uh, I don't have much hope, but we'll, we'll go ahead and get these. Uh, oh, so we got a, a, a big money note, 6,000 star, 6,550 star note. Okay. Um, there's another page. Okay, so I needed one of those. Thanks for that. And uh, these these star notes aren't, aren't quite what I was expecting. Uh, they're sky bounce. <laughs> Message in a bottle. Uh, I don't need more. So, okay, so good. We got three of those. Um, we'll put those up there. So I'm up to three of these. It'd be nice if I got some more of these uh, Soul Stone recipe pages. I don't know what it takes. I'm expecting it takes. Uh, that soul, um, a star stone or something unobtainable. But anyways, uh, yeah, so we'll keep track of that. I'm up to five buried treasures, and I did get two ant farms, so uh, hopefully we'll get one of these up and get nine of them that we can go ahead and um, convert into one of those bigger openables. So good, yep. And then, uh, oops, got to get my get kit out, and I'll keep on grinding here. Everything else I think we're doing good on. The balance is getting back up there, so we're back up to 71 already. And, oh, yeah, so I've been uh, been going along um, and putting stuff up on the auction house here. Let's see, do we get anything good? So good, so Barbarian Blades up there. Wizards up there a little bit. The Warrior Bow is good. Um, that's nice. And... Uh, nobody wants my stone boots, but that's okay. So there you go. You got a chance to get uh, something there for one star or whatever the next bit is. <laughs> um, yep, so I, I'll keep on doing that. And uh, I just come in here and pull out stuff and, and put it up on there for one star. Um, yeah, everything else. Oh, yeah, so the uh, slip and slides are doing good. I'm not seeing any big stack ups. 18 is okay. We want to keep that number as low as possible. That means we're being efficient. So as long as I don't see any big numbers, I think I'm okay with it uh, the way it is now. Up to eight there. And five there. Yep, so good. So the slip and slide of death, the way we've got this, uh, pretty happy with it. And good grief, it's got a, a X to stand on. <laughs> So got ways to go before the kit comes in, and we'll pause here and be back in a little bit. Alrighty then, time for the kit to come in. <sighs> I need some good stuff here, Skybounds. I, I I need some more seeds. I'm running out of ore seeds. I need I need everything. Three, two, one. I better have gotten some good stuff there, Skybounds. I'm telling ya. Really? Okay, well that, that is okay, not the greatest. What's this? Beet seeds. Okay, good. I got some of those. Eh. Gold ore seed. Okay, good. Good. I'll take that and the rest of this garbage I'll get later. Um, so, yep. So, I've been uh, hard at the grind here. Now let me claim up this stuff first. And seeds. I'm just going to put them in here for now. And the ore seeds up here. And so, I, yep, so I've been doing uh, quite a bit of grinding on the mining, and we have two treasure troves besides good griefs stuff. We'll claim that up. Um, I did actually buy eight of the buried treasures on the auction house for a million. I thought it was pretty good. Also, I bought some uh, beet seeds, uh, 16 for 600k, so I thought that was pretty good. Now I got more. I started a, another. Uh, layer down there. But let's go ahead and open up these treasure troves. I don't know what this is going to do. Never opened one. Three, two, one. Um, contains some items. Okay, good. So, oh, gold ore seeds. Okay. Well, those aren't too bad. Um, hmm. All right. I, I could use something a little better than that. Let's uh, um, compact emerald and diamond. Okay, good. So, yep. So I've been uh, grinding through the ore seeds since I figured these higher level ones I'm going to go ahead and do manually just so I can get the buried treasure out of them. I started putting them down and we'll keep on the grind. I did, good grief, did get some here. Um, lapis, I'm going to do coal. We'll go ahead and put that in. One of these over here has already got coal, so we'll put it right in here. 
Yep, so we got quite a bit. Oops, forgot to check. Getting close. That one's okay. That one's okay. Yep. Yep. And yep. All right, good. So I'll go ahead and keep on the grind here. We'll see where we get to. And probably won't be back uh, recording until tomorrow. And hopefully we'll be able to finish up the episode then. All right, it's another day here on Skybounds, and I am late for everything thanks to Storm. <laughs> I lost power, had to reset everything, but we are back on now and good to go. So got some stuff. We got big money note. Um, I, you know, I'm pulling out the. I'm pulling out the darn. Uh, what did we get? I didn't even see. Oh, I better better get that. Better get that. Uh, Yep, got all the stuff for the auction house. Ooh, watermelon seeds. Nice. Needed those. And where is it? What do we get? Hades. Oh, how come I couldn't get the darn fat? All right, all right. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. We can deal with that. We can deal with that. Um, Yeah, let me throw, uh, let me throw the watermelon seeds and the watermelon thing here for now. And we are going to kick it off here today with the loot crate Hades Skybounds I need some good stuff here I really really need some good stuff I know you got it in ya I, I, I no disappointment today no disappointment today no buyers remorse ooh okay ant farms not bad mahi mahi nice gold ore seed oh an auto chest okay well now we're talking now this is all stuff I can use okay yep um, kind of. All right, good. So let's see what we're going to get. Uh, a big old token, rank token would be pretty darn sweet right now because I need the stars. I need the stars. I, I'll take it. I'll take it. It's not the biggest one, but it uh, should get me something. In fact, let's take a look at AHV and see what the sun is going for. Uh, let's see where they at here. None of them up there. Did I miss them? Uh, the uh, should be rank token should be in here somewhere. Oh, there we go. Oh, so comments up there for 65. All right, good. So let me think about that for a little bit, and we'll uh, I'll get it uh, I'll get it up there on the auction house today. I'm thinking 20 million maybe. Maybe uh, maybe I'll do an auction for starting at 15 and a buyout for 25, maybe something around that. But that will give us some good money. Been cranking through the ore seeds, been getting a lot of uh, buried treasures. So we can make another treasure trove here in a little bit. And let me put this away here. Got lots to go over. Um, uh, I have been doing some grinding and we should have ores over here yep so I gotta replace nope no I gotta replace any all right so they uh, fixed it so they got the auto crafter so now you can come in here and select what you want that's unlocked on your island and you are good to go so right now I've got scrambled eggs and they, they actually this is actually pretty sweet I'm pretty happy with what they did here uh, you can see you can select whatever you want here out of the uh, menu and and I, I, um, I haven't switched to see what that does, but I think you can only select one at a time, which is okay. Now, the other thing about it is, so you can see it right there, I've got scrambled eggs up here. This tells you what you need to finish off that uh, that recipe for for one. Now, one of the things that's that that it's doing here is so. All right, let me, let me back up a little bit. Okay, so I got my standard set up, right? We got the auto crafter, then I got an output box here, an output chest. So this one here is um, if you need to filter anything out before it gets to the auto crafter. So for instance, I've got this um, egg machine here. If I put chicken eggs in here, then I want to be able to filter out the feathers and the raw chicken. Now I could put a... Um, could put a uh, a um, oven in between there 
uh, but for now I just I just put it like this I don't have any I don't have any chicken spawn eggs to put in there um, but when I do that's what I'll do is and then I'll just take the the raw chicken and and put it in the cooker over there probably there's gonna be some uh, manual stuff here anyway so see so yep, up so I got the egg machine I got a wood cutting machine and the ore machine so right now um, I've got the uh, I got the birch here, but you can see so right there it chopped, but nothing came out. Well, that's because this guy doesn't need any more birch wood, so it's not it's it's not going to suck any more birch wood into it until it finishes this one, and then it'll start the whole process for everything in the that it needs for that recipe. I did try to get a bypass around here, but I I haven't figured that out yet. So. The problem is, is without you know, so I could make this output birch, but then it's just going to fill up here until it gets to there. So that's the kind of the downside. So this this wood cutting machine here isn't going to do anything until the the auto crafter needs stuff. So now what else I've done here though is I've gone ahead and set up the conduits coming from down here from the ent drop woods drops wood and the eggs so now I've got a conduit running up here to these guys and these guys are both collecting uh, stuff right from my uh, my spawners right so we got our, our collection chest coming in here come down here then uh, the other stuff that doesn't get cooked comes here and then down across this line and now I've got the uh, separate out uh, separated out the birch so this one here is birch only and it goes to this one and then into this chest and somehow I got an egg in there that's no good <laughs> I, I switched it around a couple times um, but then this one over here is the eggs I need to put signs on that so now now I've got kind of a, a pretty automated um, and then for over here I've got a spot if I get any more coal or seeds I can put them in and if I get something else that I can get into here I've got a spot to put it but for now I'll probably just be dumping coal in there so let's grab some coal and we'll see how far this gets along let me just grab one two three four five six seven and then I'll grab I got a whole bunch of birch stacked up over here grab some birch to help it out and then some eggs and I'll just go ahead and fill up the uh, the chest that I have up here for now let me grab all these eggs that will fit no, that's good enough all right good so we got and then then the other thing is to remember to set the filter on the factory input too right so you got to have the, the factory input filter set so let's put the eggs in here oops I forget you can't double click these I'll go ahead and throw some more birch in here and then this guy is the coal so you see the coal starting up so it'll take it on this out uh, this input that's outputting onto the conveyor belt you see that it only put five in so five will come in here and boom and now we got scrambled eggs coming out now everything else says okay yep I'm ready for another batch so there we go so now it's cranking out the birch and the eggs and should be hitting up some more coal here pretty soon too I think or does it have enough coal do you have any coal here how much coal you got buddy all right got some oh yep so I had enough already um yep oh there's the coals underneath the uh the birch okay yep so good so we got that going pretty darn good i'm pretty happy with this the only thing like i said is if i had a way to bypass uh around i tried putting a conveyor from back here coming out and around and trying to suck it in from this side of the of the woodcutter but no go there so so that didn't work um I, I can't think of anything else to do other than try to do some kind of overflow chest maybe with a output and then coming back to an input but that doesn't make sense either but for now we'll go ahead and stick with this and we'll let that keep running just like it is and like I said if I get some more chicken spawn eggs we'll put them in there and then I'll just keep manually filling up the coal 
and then we'll uh, I'll probably load this stuff up manually uh, just to keep it running so I don't have to do anything so that's good so then over here we're doing pretty good so I took the uh, the birch one over there so now we just got the uh, acacia and then the watermelon and the sugar cane and I don't have any we did get um, iron ore seeds but we'll go ahead and hold off on putting those in there um, so yep so good so I think we're we're starting to figure this this stuff out and getting some automation going like that on the island is pretty good um, let's see so I bet ooh, I wanted to check that where am I at for these darn cocoa beans I've been grinding on these oh so I am getting pretty close so uh, I only need uh, 642 more um, so that's uh, uh, I only need three or four more harvest on this thing to get through it all right well good um, I've been doing the beets um, they're kind of slow growing and then on the bamboo oh yeah that's right on the bamboo that's what I was gonna say so before I was coming down here and just going along and getting hitting it at the bottom level and it all break and woohoo I'm done but the thing I realized is is the seed drop is based on the ones you actually smack <laughs> so now I'm coming along here and just going along each level and hitting each one individually uh, for each level and that way I'm getting more seeds so before I was only getting um, one seed every couple of times around this uh, when I get a seed to pop out but now if I do this I'm usually getting two or three seeds each each go around and that is a lot better for me right now uh, since I need the seeds <laughs> so let me get through this real quick I probably need to figure out a better way to set these bamboo up so that I can do it quicker um, to get that other auto chest oh but I'm at my limit for the auto chest maybe I just need to make it uh, I know what I can do. I know that wouldn't work. Uh, <laughs> sorry, just thinking to myself, don't mind me. Just uh, just rambling on. Yep, I gotta figure out a better way to do do some of this here. All right, let's see how many. After that, we better have gotten some darn seed sky bounds. That's all I know. I need two. I need two or three. Where's my seeds? Ah, I got one. All right, well, it's better than none, I guess. <laughs> so let me put this one down here. All right, good. And now let's see here. Yep, so let's check on this guy. I haven't looked at this all day. I'm expecting I got messages in. Ooh! So I got three buried treasures and two messages in the bottle. Well, that's a little bit better, I think. Um, let's go ahead and make up the. I'm gonna, like I said, I'm going to hold on to those for a little bit. How many of these we got? 15, so I can do. Uh, I can do one. <laughs> I can do one. All right. Give me something good there, Skybounds. I need some big ore seeds. What did I get? I, I didn't need any of that. Uh, a 200 emerald ore seed, though. That, that, I'll take that. I will take that. So you can see I'm running out of uh, ore seeds here. I'm going to finish up the gold, and then we're going to start on the diamond. Um, and I've got uh, full gold here, so I still need to do, figure out how I'm going to do the, whatever that is, the gold potatoes. Um, so I'm going to need more uh, more potatoes. <laughs> so maybe I ought to set up a, a semi-auto farm or something for the gold potatoes. I think about that um, and we'll see where we go from there. Uh, let's see, was there something else I was going to do? So I got my kits, right? I got all those. I got a bunch of stuff to do. Balance is doing good. We're still cranking them. Still making quite a bit of money on these guys. Um, and we're oh, what's what happened here how come I got how come I got fold here huh I didn't see that happening um, 
wonder what the heck happened here. I'm going to have to do something with this. Uh, in fact, I better take some out. Now, um, <laughs> wasn't expecting that. Uh, we got, I got Ross. I got room for some Ross stuff there. Hmm. That's problematic. Um, maybe I have to put in another, you know, it was, I was getting quite a bit of lag today, but it seems to clear it up after I just did a reboot. Maybe that was it, or maybe I need to go ahead and bite the bullet and put up another set of ovens, or do I want to go ahead and set up a auto oven? Hmm. I think about that too. So we got lots of grinding to do. We got to do the beats. Got to do more stone. Um, got to keep an eye on the factory. But I think we're gonna go ahead and call this an episode here. I know there's something I'm forgetting, but I can't think of it right now. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Thanks for your support. Make sure you're hitting that like button. Please leave me any comments, questions, suggestions down below. Please tell your friends about me. Please, please subscribe. Everyone take care and be good.